If I had someone to tell me about these three things when I just found out that I was a Sigma male, I would have been far gone by now. In fact, I would have been living the life of my dreams, fully maximizing my Sigma abilities and living one hell of a lifestyle with a happy family. But it took me two years of searching and reading to learn this three things about being a Sigma male. I started making videos on YouTube to share my experiences as a Sigma male so that no one will have to go through the mental torture, self-doubt, and sleepless nights just to figure out that nothing is wrong with who you are. I recently asked a question where most of you discovered that you were a Sigma and over 70% responded YouTube and that is where the problem begins. I am not in any way trying to discredit the works of other content creators on YouTube. What I am trying to say is that the Sigma male or Sigma female you hear about doesn't exist, at least in your imaginations to be fair. The videos on YouTube are selling you a dream that you will have to live at least 1,000 years to fulfill, and unfortunately for you, depending from which part of the world you are watching from, not everyone is guaranteed to live long. The YouTube videos you watch are feel-good stories designed to play right through your overzealous and reactive minds. But what I am going to share with you is the truth, and the truth is always bitter whether you like it or not, or whether you are ready for it or not. It took me two years to come to this realization after reading 1,001 blog articles and 189 books in psychology to figure out what every Sigma male or female should be doing to be living a life worthy of the stereotypes. The problem I have with these videos on YouTube is that they don't consider the present predicament of the Sigma male or female trying to understand themselves better. What we need is not a feel-good video but solutions to how to be a Sigma and not feel awkward and different. We need solutions on how to become like the richest Sigma men and women, or simple solutions on how to find love the easiest way possible, or how to make money as a Sigma and pay for our mortgages, because whether you like it or not, life continues whether you are Sigma or not. Once you get out of that mental space on YouTube, there are bills waiting to be paid, 101 passions to be pursued, and a family to cater for. So my question is what will you do? Will you continue to watch the feel-good videos and be happy with yourself that you are a superior man or woman, meanwhile in reality you are broke as hell, living paycheck to paycheck with a well of untapped potential? You can become anything the stereotypes say about the Sigma personality provided you one. Know that you can never become all that the Sigma stereotypes say about you. This was the very first thing I learned from consuming so much material on the internet. No matter how much information you consume, and how you feel after that, everything goes away once reality sets in. You are harshly reminded that you live on planet Earth, where you must work extremely hard to become what you want to be. Even though I learned the hard way that I was never going to be exactly the same like the Sigma male I was reading about, I also realized that I had almost the same potential as him to become successful, but the difference was that mine needed development. I needed to train myself on how to be and use those abilities to my advantage. So I stopped reading and craving for more information and I started living the life of the imaginary Sigma male in my head. I went from always procrastinating to taking action even though I am still struggling with the whole procrastination thing. Just so that we are on the same page, I still prefer to pile work until the last minute when the pressure to work is high and the reward of failing is high, that is when I feel like working. But nonetheless, I am far better than before. There are so many habits that I am getting rid of and forming new ones. You can never become 100% like the Sigma you watch or read about because of the environment in which you grow up in, your upbringing, religious beliefs, culture, and even race can hinder some of your abilities or change the trajectory of your life. But there is one thing for sure. A Sigma is a Sigma, for that there is no doubt, but what we become cannot solely be tied to the fact that you are Sigma male. After I discovered that I will never become exactly the same as the Sigma male on YouTube, I made a list of the qualities we shared, those that needed improvement, and those that were irrelevant to my dreams and passions. Not being able to be like the ideal Sigma does not mean you cannot achieve far better success in life than the one described on YouTube. The successful Sigmas alive today had their own fair share of problems. They went out and created a life for themselves instead of wallowing in self-pity and trying to explain to everyone why you are different. 
It is either you work to become what you want or keep watching the feel-good videos on YouTube and amount to nothing at the end of the day. Nobody cares if you are the most intelligent man or fall within the category of the most intelligent people when you cannot put food on the table. If you look at it carefully, the struggles we go through every day is to make sure we never lack what to eat and to be respected for the fact that you will never go hungry. 2. Nobody will make you a successful Sigma except you. The second and most important thing I learned was that I will never achieve the kind of success I wanted by simply believing in my potential as a Sigma man. Sigma males are known to be solution-driven and action-oriented, but it takes them time to get into action. Reading a total of 1,190 different blog articles and books is not child's play. I know the feeling of confusion, the endless torture from self-doubt as you try and figure out who you are. I have been there and done it. My problem with you is what you have learned so far is enough to get you started on your dreams. You don't become a Sigma by consuming all the information there is about Sigmas on the internet. You become a better Sigma by doing. The truth is a majority of Sigma males and females are lazy. We spend too much time reading and distilling ideas for other people to use. If you think I am exaggerating, ask yourself this question. Why do your friends run most of their ideas by you? Why do people like to invite you to see what they are doing or the new project they are working on? The answer is they want you to give them advice, show them what they might be missing or doing wrong, because that is what we are good at, giving free advice and knowing everything. Most Sigma males and females get exploited for this. Some people are giving out such information for a price, and these people are called consultants, counselors, and public speakers, but because you and I can easily figure that out, we don't see the need to charge for it. The truth is most Sigma males and females aren't bold enough to speak up or take the bull by the horns as the stereotypes suggest. Instead, we like to use other means to cope with our problems instead of dealing with them right away. Sigmas are blessed and prone to be successful than the average man or woman, but why are there some Sigma males and females that are still broke even though the term here is relative? But this is not sufficient. The amount of success Sigmas dream of coupled with their abilities compared to what most of them achieve at the end of the day is peanuts. It is a waste of their abilities and who they are. The reason you are not successful like the Sigma on YouTube is because of you. Stop fantasizing and giving excuses and just start doing. When people like Kiri V talk of a 24-hour grind every day indirectly, they are referring to us Sigmas. By birth we are workaholics, we don't get tired, and we don't get burnout easily because we work hard and smart. Nobody will put in the work for you to be successful, even if you hire a team. 3. Time and opportunities won't stop and wait for you to figure out your life. Time waits for no one. I took two years obsessing with learning everything there was on the internet about the Sigma personality, and the harsh truth is that after consuming so much information, mentally my mind has changed, but progress-wise and achievement-wise, I am still where I was. I would have gotten what I got from reading 1,000 plus books from a video like this. Select five books at most and read 10 blog articles and carry on with your life. The information remains the same. We live in the 21st century where everything is changing and the Sigma personality is facing brand new challenges and they need up-to-date solutions to those problems. And the only way I see that happening is if many Sigma males and females start sharing their experiences and lifestyle. Unless you want to be like the Sigma males and females in my story, then continue to do what you have been doing since you found out who you were. Continue absorbing new information and doing nothing. Continue to live in the world of fantasy that you create in your mind to feel good each time you watch a Sigma success story. But if you want out from that rat race like myself, then subscribe for more videos and watch this video to know how to make people fear you without having to say a word like myself.